show for very diverse entrepreneurs. I'm your host, June Middleton. We have a really interesting and fascinating, talented group of musicians here this evening. The, the leader, Alex Terrier, is not just a musician, but he's also launched a business on the web, which we're going to talk about. It's really fascinating, uh, all about jazz. So, um, but he has brought with him a really renowned and very talented group of musicians. I am very pleased. This is an all-star group, so let me introduce to you the Alex Terrier Quartet.
come over and sit with me so we can talk. It's Hello, June. So, it, it's just so nice to see you again. Again? Oh, yes, Same. yes, yes. My pleasure. Oh, gee, please introduce. Uh, so everybody. we have Victor Gould on piano, whom I know I met in Berkeley. Okay. Uh, so yeah, we're going to talk to him. A few years ago. And uh, we have uh, Peter Slavov on bass. Mm. I met also at Berkeley. And we have uh, Tommy Campbell, that I also met in college. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> but I met. He's from Berkeley uh, too. He, isn't did, he? he went to Berkeley too. That's You're true. That's true. People. It's a it's a Berkeley ensemble. <laughs> no, uh, I met Tommy uh, at the Mingus Big Band. We uh, played together the, with the Mingus Big Band. Wow, wow, wow. Well, okay. I'd like to talk to everyone, but first, let me bring me up to date on what's going on with you. You just came back from France. Was that vacation or were well, you playing? Well, yeah, recently I was on uh, vacation for Christmas. Mm -hmm. uh, I was uh, in France a couple of months ago for some concerts. I went to uh, California. I'm going back to California next month. I'm going to Mexico. Uh, I'm going to Canada. Well, you know, trying to stay busy. Well, um, I think you're being successful at it. Yeah, well, you're quite busy. We're doing our best. <laughs> I'm uh, going to record an album with uh, Tommy Campbell uh, pretty soon, oh, and that's great. probably Kenny Barron on piano. So that will be will be back. Oh for my that. gosh! Now, I mean, you started out playing classical music yeah. until you heard Duke Ellington. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, that well, just. Well, you I mean, were converted. Uh, yeah. Well, <laughs> the, what really happened is um, I heard um, a big band in the south of France. You know, uh, during the summer we have a lot of uh, jazz festivals in France, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. I was playing classical piano actually, and I heard the big band, and I said, "Okay, forget about the piano. Sorry, Victor, but <laughs> that's what <laughs> happened." And I picked up the saxophone, you know, and. And the rest is oh, history. Gee. Now, when you were last, this is your, I think, fourth time visiting with us, and Something you were else. here with Fred LeVale. I came with Fred, and I came with uh, Martin Verano, you know, yes, uh, with yes, Chia's yes. dance party. Yeah, yeah. And you had, uh, were doing some business with uh, the LeVale yeah. mouthpieces. Yeah, we were which doing this mouthpiece, actually, uh -huh. which. Oh, that's great. My so, name. but now you have. You've started another business. Yeah, well, I mean, it's, uh, I don't know if uh, business might be a big word for that. It's an educational website. Um, Is it something that you started, that you're doing, that yeah. you have people come to you? It's a yeah. business. Yeah. <laughs> As a business attorney, I can tell you all right. it's a business. So. What is it all and about? It's it, uh, an internet-based business? Yeah, exactly. So I have a, a website, and basically what I do is that I produce uh, videos where mm -hmm. I give a lesson. Um, and also, like, it can be also uh, less uh, formal. Like, sometimes it, it's just, like, something that I'm rehearsing, I'm practicing something, you know. So it's a way for me to share information with uh, students like since I'm traveling quite a bit I have uh, some people want to are interested to uh, take lessons with me now, it's what not is always the, possible. What's the level of the student that you have? Are these professionals like these gentlemen? Uh, that no you have no with well you, I mean I'm taking I'm lessons from them. <laughs> <laughs> um, no no it's more like you know like beginners to intermediate then at, at a certain level Mm -hmm. You know, nothing will replace having a one-on-one. A -on -one, right. Uh, I mean, everything is so interactive now. Everything is on the internet. I mean, how do you relate to students if you are teaching them? Uh, well, in cyberspace, so to speak. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Well, um, the thing is that I try to be as interactive as possible with uh, the the users. They can they can uh, write comments on the videos. They can ask mm. questions. Oh, okay. Uh, so, so it's, it's not like it's a static real thing. time. Yeah. Well, no, no, no. It's not real time. Oh, it is. Uh, I can do that with uh, Skype, for for instance. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. here, no, it's not real time. We, we can write uh, comments or questions. You know, if something is not clear, or if uh, we didn't understand something. Uh, they can write a comment on the v on those videos, and mm -hmm. I answer them either by a new video or oh, writing. This comments. is great. Now you have a library of videos yeah. that people can select from. Yeah, exactly. Oh, uh, so, and what and is your this website? Is, this is uh, exponential because, like, I put like two to four videos per month. Oh, great! And what's the website? Jazzvideolessons.net. Jazz dot net. net. Yes. Oh, this is great. Well, you're a pianist, like you and. Your other gentlemen here all came out of Berkeley. 
Yeah. And I've had a lot of people on the show out of Berkeley, Manhattan School of Music, Juilliard. It's just so many talented people. It's wonderful, wonderful to be here in New York. So I'd like to talk to your piano player. Victor. Victor. Welcome. Yeah. Hello. Welcome. Thank Welcome. You. Welcome. Where's home for you? I'm from Los Angeles, California. Mm -hmm. Now, you've received a lot of very prestigious awards. Uh, what, a Herbie Hancock um, award or a scholarship? Oh, um, that was, yeah. And uh, ASCAP, you know, as a young jazz up-and-coming musician. Oh. oh, yeah, the Herbie Hancock was a presidential scholarship. Oh, oh my yeah. gosh. And so, uh, when did you start playing? I started playing piano when I was four, four years old. That late? Uh, <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah. Um, was that your first instrument of choice? Yes, yeah. Started playing classical piano and then started playing the church around 12, 11 mm -hmm. or 12. And, uh, now, did you also uh, have something to do with Thelonious, Thelonious Monk? Did you attend uh, a school or what? Tell us about your, um, the connection that you had with that, where Thelonious Monk is concerned. Uh, the Lawrence Monk Institute is a, a, grad, a grad, grad school program. Um, it was in New Orleans at the time. Um, yeah, I got my master's degree from that. It was mostly focused on uh, outreach programs and uh, mm -hmm. teaching kids and you know giving back to the community. Oh, great. Now, are you also currently working on your own album? Yeah, yeah. Soon I'll be uh, in March. You I'll, act I'll like that's a surprise. I yeah. mean... <laughs> Yeah, I'll, you I'll be are, aren't my first you? record in March. Okay, you're going to come and debut it here? Hopefully, yeah. Yeah, that would be great. It's a date. <laughs> All right. Yeah. <laughs> okay, that's wonderful. And Peter, welcome. Welcome to the show. It's so nice to have you here. Give him uh, the mic if you would. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, where is home for you? Um, well, I've been living in New York for the past seven years. Seven years? Yeah. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. I'm originally from Bulgaria, mm. Sofia, Bulgaria. Yeah, Ten. we've had, I've had classical musicians on from Bulgaria, um, Avgust Antonov, and uh, I think he's a concert pianist, as well as Kalin Ivanov, okay. a cellist. Nice. And, oh, you know him? Or you know uh, of him? Well, I know of them. Ah, yes. yeah, they've been guests on the nice. show, which is really terrific. This is a very diverse show, and it's oh. international in scope. So it's just wonderful to have all of these wonderfully talented musicians here. So tell us, uh, what's the jazz scene like in Bulgaria? Uh, not, not too developed. Um, you know, my, my father was one of the first like, uh, modern jazz musicians in really? Bulgaria. Yeah. Oh. And uh, he was a drummer. So um, uh, growing up, I, you know, I, I heard a lot of you know, Coltrane and, and mm -hmm. Miles and, you know, oh. all the... Um, and then you got you know. converted as well. Yeah, <laughs> the funny thing is that at the time I wasn't really into jazz. I was studying classical music, but I was really into, like, rock and, you know, mm -hmm. whatever. Now, the, do yeah. you teach uh, at a university in uh, um, Sofia, um, well, in Bulgaria? Well, I'm doing an annual master's class. Or a master's class. class. Yeah, every, um, each September, first two weeks of September. Mm -hmm at a university in Sofia, yes. Now, did you start out on the bass? I started on piano, ah. classical piano. Classical when was, piano. Yeah, when I was six, oh I was indeed. a late bloomer, <laughs> I mean, compared to Victor. <laughs> well, it's delight delightful to have you yeah. here. Thank Absolutely you. delightful. Tell me how nice to have you here. We have, you have something in common with my brother, Absolutely. John B. Williams. You both played with Manhattan Transfer yep. at different times. That's right. That's, that's, that's right. terrific. It's great. That's, and he sends you a great big hello. Oh, thank you. And likewise, <laughs> I saw so, him last uh, in Japan. Yeah. yeah. Now, you're also a graduate of Berkeley, and, or you teach there, or you did teach I'm, there at I'm one time? Technically, I'm not. I might as well, since we're on TV, otherwise I would lie. But um, <laughs> um, <laughs> no, I technically I did not graduate from Berkeley, but I did okay. go four semesters. No, you graduated from the school of Dizzy Gillespie. Exactly, exactly. And That's later I went back to teach at Berkeley. Ten years later, and the president of Berkeley now, Roger Brown, is my former drum student. Mm. Now you grew up in a musical family. Mm. Yes. Yes. You have um, your uncle. Yes. 
Jimmy Smith. Tell us, Jimmy organist? Smith, yes. We're that all from well Nor- known. Yes, yes. We're <laughs> oh, all that's... from Norristown, Pennsylvania, just outside Philadelphia. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. Well, it's just really so incredible to have someone of your stature here as well. And I'm, I'm just honor. thrilled and delighted that you came. Thank you so much, Jane. It's it, great it, it, to be here. It's just such that. a pleasure. You have to come back. I, I definitely want to. I okay, will. okay. So this is without a doubt, Alex, an all star group. Without a doubt. So let's hear some more of your music. What are you going to play? We're going to play a ballad um, that I wrote in the style of Billy Treon. Well, ah, I mean, very wow. humbly. I'm, okay, I'm trying. And ahead. it's called Song for Kelly. Song for Kelly. All right.
That was beautiful. Absolutely wonderful. Now, I know that we want to have time for you to play one more piece. So, what can you play? We're going to play the schmoozer. Okay. Blues, some kind of a blues. It's okay. a little tricky okay, blues. Okay, please. And this is one that you wrote also, yes? Exactly, yeah. Okay, hit it. Right on it. No intro to Oh, you are absolutely great, absolutely terrific. And I want to just thank our director, our crew in the control room, Joyce, Ed, my son, who's the director, and also a very special thanks to Rich and Manhattan Neighborhood Network for making this show possible. You have been watching Minding Your Business, the show for absolutely incredibly talented, very diverse entrepreneurs. And please, see yourself 
where you want to be. And come back and join us again next time. And Alex, thank you so much. Thank you, Victor, Jim. Peter, Tommy, what a pleasure. What an incredible pleasure. You're just all so talented. And I want you all to come back. Thank you. So it's just been wonderful. Thank you. And I think that um, we're out of time. And good luck with your new venture. Thank you. Like to see it become very successful? Me too. <laughs>